Hey y'all, Pat Kelly here, Mad River Outfitters, guide and fly manager here at the store. Today we're gonna to be discussing my three leader options when fishing poppers for bass. All right, so the first leader that we're gonna talk about is what I use when I'm throwing the largest bass poppers. Big hair bugs, divers, um, our favorite here at the store, the Umqua Swimming Frog. This is kind of my go-to rig when I'm guiding and fishing. Um, generally like a seven weight rod, nine foot seven weight, lines, the, the tight and long bass bug or the uh, scientific anglers and the adro are kind of my go-tos. But here is my leader for the largest flies, big deer hair stuff. So I'll run a four foot butt section of 30 pound maxima. Then I will go and drop down. I like to use a blood knot for my connection points here. From there, I'll step down to two feet of 20 pound maxima. And then I'll step down one more time and then run two feet of 15 pound maxima. That's uh, you know, eight feet in length, you know, you really don't want to go any longer than eight feet. It just makes it a lot more difficult to turn the flies over and to cast efficiently and effectively. So that's my rig for throwing the big deer hair stuff. All right, the second leader is going to be, <clears throat> this formula is what I use for my boogle bugs, my double barrels, you know, just your average, you know, average poppers. So butt section is going to be exactly the same thing. We're going to run four feet of 30 pound maxima for the butt. Next section is going to be two feet of 20 pound maxima. And then the one change that takes place is right at the very end. I'll run two feet of 12 pound maxima. And from there, I'll tie my fly on. All right, last but not least is going to be the leader that I use anytime I'm fishing a smaller popper, uh, terrestrials, you know, anytime you're dead drifting, you know dragonfly patterns, cicadas, uh, you know, the fat Albert, anything smaller like that if you're dealing with really low or super clear water. Again, nothing's gonna change on the butt section. Four feet of 30 pound maxima. From there, two feet of 20. Change it up a little bit here. After the 20, I'll only run a foot of 15, and then I will run a foot of 12 pound maxima. And then from there, I will run about uh, 15 to 18 inches of zero X. So that's gonna be my setup for the smaller poppers or anytime I'm fishing, you know, larger terrestrials and, and dead drifting in clear water situations. For any of you out there who do not tie your own leaders or if you wanna save some time, uh, we do sell some great options that are pre-made here at the store that you can get on the website. Um, first one's going to be the uh, Scientific Anglers makes a leader called the Hard Mono Leader. Comes in at seven and a half feet long. <clears throat> Comes in a few different sizes. <clears throat> you know, the two that I use probably most frequently are going to be the 16 pound and the 12 pound. So, kind of building on what I did with the leader that I use personally and build myself. You know, the 16 pound is what you would want to use anytime you're fishing, you know, your bigger hair frogs and divers. The 12 pound is something that you would want to pair with your boogle bugs or double barrels. Um, you know, and if you're going to be fishing smaller terrestrials, you can simply take that 12 pound leader and add, you know, a foot of zero X on the end of it and you'd be set up for those you know, smaller flies. The other option is going to be from uh, Rio. It's called the Big Nasty Leader. It comes in... in in about four sizes that we carry, we carry a 20 pound, 16 pound, 12 and, uh, and 10. This being a six foot leader, I wouldn't necessarily recommend this for, you know, fishing the terrestrials or dead drifting those smaller flies like we talked about earlier. There's really two uh, that I would kind of look at. One would be the 16. So similar to the scientific anglers, the diameter on this is 016. Um, you know, if you're looking for a tip of material to match up with this, it would be the 15 pound maxima, but this is what you would use. Uh, for the bigger hair frogs. And the, the second option would be the 12 pound. So 014 in diameter, that would be something to use with the, you know, boogle bugs, double barrels, things like that. So hope that helps you out. Head over to the website, buy a few leaders, buy some stuff to tie your own leaders, um, pick up some flies, definitely boogle bugs, get out there, catch some fish. Thanks for watching. Smash that like button. Like, crush it, smash it. Leave a comment below. Let us know. Do you tie your own leaders or do you buy your own? Be sure to hit the subscribe button and let us know if we can help with anything. This is Pat Kelly from Mad River Outfitters. 
signing off. Stay classy, San Diego. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. And check out these videos. We think you might like them too.